Hi guys, what's up? <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. So, ito naman ako. So, for today, ang ating video is all about how to pass your demo class. Kids edition. <laughs> this is just in case the student that you're going to have on your demo class is a kid. But actually, it's not really a kid. It's just like, they will pretend as a kid. But the main point there is you must imagine that your student is a kid. It's a child, the beginner, a seven, six, five, four, three, two, one joke. Okay, <laughs> let's say four years old up to ten years old, like that. Okay, so let's start. I will not count how many tips it will be. So let's start with before the demo class. So when the employer or the employer when the company will give you let's say they will give you the lesson material that you're going to teach but most of the time they will be talking about animals yeah when it comes to kids usually the lesson or the topic is all about animals so first of all is you prepare all the things that you need prepare stuffed toys um, if it's not animals, let's say if it's all about alphabet, so prepare flashcards like that. Prepare your props. And of course, wear your cutie headband. Blah, blah, blah. Like that. So anything that makes you look friendly. Because, um, yung mga bata kasi, children, if they, um, let's say, first impression nila sayo, and you're just looking like this. Ganito lang ka simple. Hindi friendly yung first impression nila sa'yo. They might be scared. They might be shy. Like that. But if you wear something that would make you look, uh, that would make you look friendly, like, hi! Like that. Hey, I'm good for you. Like, hi! Ganun ka. If you look friendly, then they would be, hindi sila mahihiya and hindi sila matatakot sa'yo. So, yeah, ganun. Prepare all the things you need. Your props. And of course, don't forget your rewards. Let's say, uh, they call it cut, cut out. Stars, like that. And I lost mine. Ewan ko, natapon yata sa ano. Parang nabasa yata. Ewan ko kung nasa sila. Gagawa na lang ako ng ulit ng bago. So, flash cards, cut out, prepare ka ng stars, print mo, lagay mo sa stick, ganun. So, prepare mo lang siya. Ganun. And then, okay, yun ang before demo class. Be prepared always, okay? We must check, um, check your internet connection. Do a speed test at www.speedtest.net Then, check your microphone. If you're going to conduct it through Skype, then of course, do a Skype-free test call, call test service. Parang ganun. Basta, may test na test call, try call. I ko anong tawag dun sa Skype. Basta. And then, if you have a friend, you could try to call them to check if your camera is good, your microphone, your um, headset is working. Like that course, to check also if okay ba yung internet mo, hindi ka ba naglalag, hindi ka ba nag-freeze, nag-blur, ganun. And also, um, make sure, um, be online 30 or 20 minutes before the set time, before the schedule. Like that. So, um, you must chat the, let's say, the student, kunyari, you must chat them that uh, you remind like that, that you are going to have your micro lesson like that, and you are ready, and then sabihin mo, um, i, i, parang, i-check mo lang yung date, yung time, like that, and i-check mo lang, and of course, make a first impression, be early, so diba, i-check mo sila ng maaga, and possible, minsan, pag sinabi mo I'm ready, kahit hindi pa yan yung time, magsa-start na sila, if you approve, if you agree, ganun, so, okay, so yun yung before the, uh, and also watch videos, watch videos, tips, sample videos like that for you to have idea on what to do. And then during the, during the mock lesson or the demo class, during that, 
so kids and students natin. So of course, don't forget to have a very big smile. Always have a smile from the start until the end. Dapat naka smile ka lang, okay? <laughs> but usually it takes about 10 to 30 minutes. Ganyan lang naman yung mga makwasa. So 10 to 30 minutes ka lang to smile. Kaya mo yan. Lawan. Okay, so ang aim natin, ang goal natin dito is to pass the mock lesson or the demo class. So don't forget to smile and have energy. Be energetic. Always have your energy. Welcome, mag. Hi. Good day. Good afternoon. My name is Shella. Welcome, good There's like, hi, hello, good afternoon. How are you? Like that. Oh, my name is Teacher Shella. How about you? What is your name? Like that. So always be energetic. John. Okay, so ayon, be energetic. Always smile. And always feel the core. Always get the attention of your student. Like be funny. Like give some jokes a little jokes like that about the lesson and of course this is the most important before you start the lesson proper after you introduce yourself in between make um let's say an energizer like a song like for me um when I, when my topic is all about animals the song i have is rabbit 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 elephant elephant Panda, 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 panda. Ooh, monkey or monkey pig, monkey pig. But of course, my actions. Rabbit, 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 rabbit. Elephant, elephant. Panda, 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 panda. Monkey pig, monkey pig. Ganon. <laughs> and of course, make sure na uh, gawin yun. Make sure na gawin. Make sure that your student will also do it. Okay. Um, just to build rapport, just to, just as an icebreaker before, mm -hmm. it's like a warm up before you start your class. So, of course, during the class, make sure to be energetic. Make sure that your student or it's a child, so it it's kind of hard to get its attention. So make sure that you're getting its attention. Paano? By flashcards. Tough toys, um, rewards, the stars, like that. So, and of course, lagi mo silang po purihin. Of course, always make compliments. Like, wow, very good, good job, high five, like that, high five. Ganyan. So, yeah, parang wow, parang parang na excite na si student pag pinapakita mo na i-excite ka din so ganyan siya and of course after the class don't forget to make um, a recap or review sometimes pwede mong idaan sa games like okay let's have a guessing game I will show you the, the toy and you tell me what kind of animal is it then what is this like that so that's, that's a review as well so parang um, dinadaan mo lang sa games yung review para makuha mo pa rin ang attention ni student. Ganun lang. And of course, before you end the mock lesson or the demo class, always say, um, you did great. You are very smart. Give it up. Like that. And then, thank you so much and have a nice day. Bye-bye. Like that. So, of course, don't forget to always smile don't remove the smile on your face kahit nakakangawit na yan demo class to okay always remember that it's a demo class you are being observed you are being graded but be confident pa rin huwag mo ipahalata na kinakabahan ka na <laughs> just like me pag nagda-demo ako hindi ko pinapahalata but after that sinasabi ko pag na how are you feeling after you demo class I feel nervous but now I feel relieved parang ganun ka so I think that's it. Yeah, lang yan lang yung mga tips ko for demo class kids edition for kids and students niya. 
Okay, so sana makatulong ako sa inyo and I hope na pumasa kayo sa demo class niyo sa kahit anong company. Yun lang, thank you so much sa panonood and I hope na mag-subscribe kayo sa akin channel and I hope mag-comment kayo sa kahit ano pang videos na gusto nyo gawin ko. Kahit hindi about ESL, kahit challenges, anything, and skin barlet. <laughs> so, yun lang guys. Thank you so much and sana maganda ang araw niyo. Have a nice day ahead. Bye-bye. I love you all.